Kanye West, he is not done with his mother-in-law. He is busy calling out, you know, his mother-in-law on social media, busy dragging her like a wet mop. So anyway, my people, if you are coming across my channel for the very first beginning, of course, I do react to celebrity news and trending topic. So Kanye West, from the very first beginning that he entered into this family, he knew what he was like putting his life into. He was like dating a very beautiful young lady there in the United States of America called Amber Rose. When he saw, of course, when he saw Kim Kardashian, you know, pretending to be like the most sweetest angel on this earth, he thought that maybe he got, you know, a very young, talented lady. He dumped, he dumped, he dumped, you know, Amber Rose, the bold one, the one who's always like putting some colors on, on her head. Of course, you know, she's a very beautiful lady in her, in her own way. So Kim Kardashian stole Kanye West's heart. So Kanye West, you know, he was like seen there in the United States of America. Many, I'm talking about something that happened many, many, many years. So Kanye West, the, the time when he dumped Amber Rose, he started, you know, running, running around there in Calabasi looking for Kim Kardashian, you know, in Paris, France. He was like trying his level best you know, to get attention from Kim Kardashian. So by that time, Kim Kardashian, you know, she was like known, you know, for mopping, you know, Paris, Paris sweat drop, mopping on the toilet. That's what Kim Kardashian, she was like known. So Kanye West, he never gave up. No, when it came to Kim Kardashian, he insisted until Kim Kardashian got Kanye West's attention as well. They started dating. By that time, Kim Kardashian, she was like dating another player there in the United States of America. She got married to that man for 72 hours and dumped the man and got a lot of money through dumping that man, allegedly. So Kanye West, he knew what he was like putting himself into. He never gave up. Gave up. He continued. And some people on social media, they have been calling out Kanye West saying that no, he was the reason why Kim Kardashian dumped the, the first husband. I'm not sure if it's the first husband or the second husband you know chris humphrey i'm talking about chris humphrey chris humphrey i'm not talking about the other one i'm not talking about the african-american yes the african-american we're going to talk about him in another video so kanye was he was like believed to be the main reason why kim kardashian broke up you know with chris humphrey chris humphrey went through humiliation when it came to kim kardashian but still Kanye West never gave up on Kim Kardashian. So at this moment, some people are laughing at Kanye West on social media. He is busy bashing, bashing, you know, the mother-in-law. At this moment, he even went further, you know, and taking, you know, Chris Jenner's profile picture and putting it on his own profile picture. Some people are saying that, you no, know, he's apologizing. But some people are saying that he's trolling his mother-in-law. Just imagine having a son-in-law always, like, insulting you, always, you know, bashing you on social media. Of course, you know, some people might find it as an, as, as an insult, you know, like always, you know, bashing your mother-in-law. It's, it's not just, I think it's, he's like very disrespectful. Of course, he might not like, you know, Chris Jenner, but I just think that, you no, know, the manner that he's taking his grudge is not sweet, you know, because some people are looking at his characteristic, his behavior. And a lot of people are not supporting what he's like always doing because one minute he's apologizing to the Kardashian, one minute he's bashing them. And some people are saying that, no, it could be that maybe Kanye West at this moment, he's missing, you know, being around, you know, the Kardashian and the Jenner family. Because this family, it seems as if they want nothing to do with him. And also Kris Jenner, she was like seen there on social media, you know, I think she was like throwing some shades, you know, saying that it has always, it's, it's always so special spending time with Kylie, but oh, but we also have this trail looming over our head. She was like throwing some shade towards Black China because Black China, she was also like, you know, trying to sue them, you know, for a lot of money. And she lost the case. That's what they were like talking about, you know. So, guys, what's your thought when it comes to Kanye West? Do you think that maybe his beef with Chris Jenner, is it going to end soon? Or do you think that maybe Chris Jenner is going to give Kanye West a cease and desist in order for him, you know, to stop talking because at this moment he's dealing, I think Kanye West, you know, he's like fighting a lot of people because he's fighting Adidas, he's fighting Gap, you know, because I don't know, he, I don't believe that maybe he's not always like reading, you know, his contract. I'm not saying that maybe he's not reading. I'm saying that it comes across as if, you know, he's always like putting himself in problems because at this moment, a lot of people are like coming against, against him. Of course, he is like trying to defend himself because he was like saying that you no, know, he's trying to give his narrative. But even though his narrative is not always like good because they are always like bashing him on social media. Of course, I am a big fan of Kanye West, but I'm not always like supporting his. 
antics on social media especially when he's always like bashing the mother of his children it's not good because one day those children are going to grow up and seeing what he has been doing to their mother and they are not going to like that nevertheless guys you can leave your comment in the comment section down below what's your thought when it comes to chris jenner and kanye west do you think that maybe one day they are going to resolve their problem that they have been facing for so many years leave your comment in the comment section down below and don't forget to subscribe my channel for more information concerning celebrity news and trending topic bye my lovely people